Jersey Sports Zone's coverage of the Tournament of Champions is brought to you by RWJ Barnabas Health. A great crowd at Morristown High to see the two-seed Colonials in the Tournament of Champions semifinals. It's Morristown hosting Oak Knoll. The Royals, the defending TOC champs, raced out to a 5-2 lead in the first half. Morristown closes out the first half with a surge. Elizabeth Botza hits the turf hard, but the recovery is amazing. Botza gets to her feet and splits the defense for an awesome goal. The senior heading to Lehigh makes an incredible recovery. The Colonials rally for two straight late at the half. It's Oak Knoll with a 5-4 lead. Morristown carries the momentum into the second half. Megan O'Brien on the wraparound, scoring with her left. Three straight goals for Morristown, and we've got a 5-5 game. Oak Knoll doesn't panic. Darby Campbell has had a huge junior season. This is her 50th goal of the year. Campbell gives Oak Knoll the lead back. The Royals are in front 6-5. Less than a minute later, Caroline Sheridan with a great move to beat the defender and then shows a double move to score. With 17 minutes to go, it's Oak Knoll leading 7-5. A key spot here now. Oak Knoll up 8-6. Sophia Loeschert shows how important stick work is beyond shooting. Loeschert is able to create a turnover, find the ground ball, and quickly turn up field. Loeschert goes the distance for an awesome goal. Loeschert had a hat trick and the Royals built a three goal cushion. Campbell had a four point game. This is her second goal. Oak Knoll now with a 10-6 advantage. The Royals are dominant in the second half. The key to the victory was top flight defense by Oak Knoll's back line. Trinity Koji and Tatum Kose were able to get their sticks on multiple eight meter attempts. Madeline Seppi finished with five saves in goal. The scoring closed out with Campbell feeding Tegan Kose, who fires a missile from short range. Kose had a hat trick, and Oak Knoll is through to the last Tournament of Champions final. 11-6 is your final. The Royals are now 21-4 on the season and will face Summit in the last ever TFC final. The two teams split in two games this season. Darby Campbell cannot wait for Saturday's championship game. It's what we talk about every single day. It's what our theme is about now or never. Like this is the last one. So we win it now or we never will again. And I think this is what I dream about every single day. So we're just going to go out there and give it our best. Yeah, I think just keeping our composure the whole game. Today we really brought the energy. It was unmatched. You can tell even on the bus ride on the way here. We showed up, we came ready to play, and it was great to come out on top. In Morristown with Rich Grampanis, I'm Jay Cook for JerseySportsZone.com.